Now let's look at question number three. The question number three says we have a flu uh, fluid flow field which is represented by this vector which is ax i cap plus a y j cap. The equation of the streamline passing through one two is one of these four options. Now the equation of streamline we know it is dx upon u is equal to dy upon v. Now we need to recognize u and v. So if you write down the general expression for a velocity vector, it is u i cap plus v j cap. So when you compare these two equations, you get u as a x and v as a y. A can be any constant. So I'll put u equal to x over here and v equal to a y over here. So you will get dx upon ax is equal to dy upon ay. You can strike off a from both sides and then we'll integrate and we'll add one constant log of c. So this will become log of x is equal to log of y plus log of c. So you can take off all the logs you will get x is equal to y into c. Okay. Now the point at which or through which this streamline is passing is 1 comma 2. So I will put x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 2 to find out the value for c. So you will get 1 is equal to 2c or c will be equal to 1 by 2. So I will put it over here. The equation will become x is equal to y upon 2 which means it is 2x is equal to y or 2x minus y equal to 0. Now this equation corresponds to option number c. So option number c is the correct one. So in this you have to remember the equation of a streamline and then simply put the values 1 2 to get the equation. Also you need to remember the general form of the velocity vector in any flow field. So I hope you understood this. Now let's move on to question number 4.